Hello, hello. Welcome back. I don't think I need this gas mask anymore. So how are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. Uh, we had a couple more locations to check out before we pushed on with the main objective. So let's take a look at those. We have this little thing over here and then our final thing right to our right, which is where we're aiming, which will then take us over that way into the terminal. And then we could check out all of this stuff on the way back. Uh, so yeah, that should be good. Should be swell. Let's give it a shot. First off this direction. Not gonna be far, it's that little building. The map looks a lot bigger than it really is. How are we doing on ammo? 18, 36 shots. Not bad. Okay. We're gonna keep our flashlight on. But we're gonna try and take these guys from a distance. Okay, there's one. This. No, that is not a person. Although it is, it is a bit gassy in here. Okay. Well, gassy's fine. It is very spicy. Let's heal up real quick. Hold tight, Artyom. Let's not die. Okay, a bigger cylinder. Is that everything? Okay, I think that's everything. All right, so that was that place. All done. We are somewhat bleeding to death, but that's okay. Uh, let's open up my pack real quick. I think we just got an upgrade for our pistol. A couple of those. Here we go, look at this. So we got... A six shot double action cylinder. Oh, it's a lesser upgrade of what we actually have. Okay. Well, then we keep what we got. There's our boat. Oh, we got shrimp. Excuse me? Ugh. I hope they stay over there. Let's go inside. 
Okay, we got a crafting bench. Is it the crafting bench? So we have an extended filter, which allows us to have more uh, airtime. Reinforced helmet. I think I like this better. Okay, we got some options. Ammo pouches. Let's just have more ammo. Or let's just have more throwables. I think I like... Great ammunition preventing it. You know what? Let's do that. That one's good. And uh, by the way, I dislike this thing with a passion at this point and just haven't reached a bench that I can replace it with. So we're good. Let's uh, fix that. I do this every time. That's not what I meant to do, game. Let's see. Let's clean. Okay, now we're good. I gotta keep, I gotta stop hitting escape every single time. Okay. So I think we're just gonna head into that opening. Listen, we're here. We're friendly. We're here to worship the starfish. We are not using any flashlights, you know, shun the non-believers. Uh, no matter what happens, uh, there's no reason to want to harm us, right? We're here on pilgrimage. Um, everything's safe and fine and, you know, guns are okay their explosive technology, not electronic. Ugh. The vines are like shying away. Um. Oh boy. Okay. That bodes well, that bodes well. Oh. Listen, you stay outside. Why would they have a pilgrimage where you're surrounded? Like, surrounded by mutants everywhere. Do I have enough ammo for this? Uh, 60, 20. Yeah, I think we're okay. Oh, grenade. Fish? Oh, yeah. I saw his tail. Where to? Down here?
That was unkind. I'm sorry, I double clicked there. Is someone hitting me from behind? Was he hitting me on the ground? He didn't even have a hitting animation. Oh goodness, it's gonna be this kind of map. Everything's gonna want me dead like that. Okay, uh, let's grab this. Oh hey, we were given a key. Tape. Is for the most part accumulated in the sediment and as a result affects the benthic community the most. The active agent provokes pronounced pathologies in the crustacean and mold of young, which quickly proved to be fatal. Yet the catfish hatchlings in the test basin have not only survived and remained completely unharmed, but quite unexpectedly have overtaken the control groups in terms of growth by a factor of at least four. The agent does not seem to impact the pelagic fish species that much. The perch and roach young have shown a marginal increase in growth with no apparent negative effect. Okay. Uh, I can't get rid of the ghosting. I was trying to, but it messes with my FPS to really reduce that. And I'd rather have a uh, smooth turn then a uh i'd rather have it have a smooth turning radius rather than a uh non-ghosting iron sight you know what i mean can't go out that way oh uh, I guess I gotta go the other way then out we go now the question we have to ask ourselves are we gonna notice the other mutants that are coming after us or is the game just going to say screw you and drop them from the sky? What's happening here? Sit down. Nobody likes you. What the what? Okay. Fish. Oh, this whole thing's swinging, huh? Oh, all right. Yeah, no, I'm cool with this. This is fine. Um, I hear them. Where are they? 
<laughs> what in the world's over there? Okay. Game, no. Listen, none of you have talked to me in a long time, so does it really matter? S <clears throat> I see him. I see him. No, I missed. Well, they're coming now. Anyways, uh, if you notice, I've been getting a little bit more loot per uh, pickup because honestly, I'm gonna start playing through Dead Space and I really didn't want to suffer in two games at the same time at this point. Uh, never played Dead Space. So the remake's a perfect opportunity and uh, I'm terrified. I don't do well with high anxiety games or jump scares. And uh, as you can already tell with a few of them here, the moment something abrupt happens, I start to lose my cool. So that series is going to be very interesting. I can almost guarantee it. If not for you, then for me as I try not to cry. Uh, but yeah, so I decided to switch back down to normal, sort of just enjoy this story more than I simply just struggle, you know? Listen, here's the deal. I don't talk anyways, so it doesn't matter that I'm not talking now. <gasps> it didn't kill him. Oh, here they come. Where'd he go? Why is he back there? Pretty well done. Listen, how many bullets? Okay, how many bullets do you need? And why? Is it simply that my aim is bad? Or is that you have way too much health? Oh, you brought a dog in here to die? Nice. Are we going down now? No, I've been here. Where am I going? This way. What are those? Do 
to be or not to be. That is a fish. Why are they trying so hard to get a hold of me? Like, they know Artyom doesn't talk, right? Oh, no, please don't. Why am I suffocating? Did I just die? Excuse me? I had my mask on. What? Hold on. Hold on. That's... That doesn't make any sense. I had time on my mask left. Right? Like, I'm not crazy. the mask on says my filters going I am wearing a mask it is not cracked it is not busted up it seems functional I'm not suffocating right now. Did I not put my mask on last time? Cause I, cause I could swear. Oh, okay. Hi. When in doubt, throwing knives. Not my problem. Listen, they're not all chasing me right now. You can go away. I took my mask off, put it back on. 
Because we're not going to go up that way. Um, it doesn't look like there's any bodies either. So down we go. Into the stink. Okay. Okay. Into the tunnel. Well, thank you, lizard fish. Excuse me, did you just lift that wall? Do that? Person, servant of Lord Alaventina, age 79, died of old age. Uh, died of mushroom poisoning, a lack of faith. Uh, a lack of faith. A lack of faith. A lack of faith. Consumption? A lack of faith devoured by the sarfish when drowning water. Hunger. Oh, that's sad. Gargoyle attack. Oh, they're not called demons. They're called gargoyles. Okay. In this one. Um, what is a heathen atrocity? Oh, wait. Hold on. Are these people... Uh, is her name Talia? The, or no, the little girl. And her mom. Are these the people that were with them? Wow. That's... Oh. Man, this place has had some problems. Caught the fever while tending to the sick. Okay, well, that is troublesome. Anyways. Uh, oh, here's the door we could have started at. So we wait for him to, he's going to jump up at me. Okay. Now we feed him. We got to wait patiently until he comes back around. Starts munching on the bodies and then get him. Take that, you dumb fish. <laughs> we got him. Oh no, what? That 
was rude. Is it still growling? Why does it growl when I shoot it? Ugh, got torn up. Anyways, third time's a charm on the fishing one. Would you believe it? There's no benefit to do that or not to do it. I did it solely out of spite. Because they deserve it. Anyways. Artyom, do you know how to work a train? No, you're just going to flick. Okay, you're just going to flick switches. Um... Let's see, what do we got? We have some postcards. Got a little bobblehead dog there. That's cute. He's got some stickers. Some pictures of Jesus. A little duffel bag. Some lucky dice. Man, he's living the life in here. Music player. Guess we're just gonna go backwards, just back our way out. say about me so did you get that rail car yes you should get to the depot now watch your step though Artyomich there's a few shady characters over there actually a whole bunch well in case of any trouble you know what to do are you implying I need to kill them all because the answer is gladly Ammo. Okay. Clean that one up and my mask is fine. Okay. Let's see what this has to say. Some people. But what 
difference does the color of a cat make as long as the cat catches the rats? Oh, point. Shalantius is right. We have to get rid of the rest of the equipment. It does attract the ball lightning, and it's not like we are ever going to restore the normal supply of electricity without our generator. So, what's the point in taking a risk by keeping the stuff? We can live without it. October 7th. Roman is dead. That catfish. Yes, there was no real need to gather everyone. We could have gone through it gradually. And it is true that some of the actual useful stuff got thrown into the river too. But such things are bound to happen. It's hardly worth starting a commotion over it, jumping into the water. <sighs> he definitely could feel the power seeping through his fingers. But to go so far as to raise a hand against Salantius? It happened exactly the way the man told us it would too. December 31st. The tape is coming to an end, just as this year. God willing, our troubles are going to end with it, too. We're no longer alone in this world. The God is with us, so who could stand against us? Not me, that's for sure. And this means this long... Man, in a matter of months. A New Year's Eve is a perfect time to turn a new page. <laughs> Besides, as Father Salantius says, electricity is a sin. Dude flipped a complete switch. Wow. All right. Well, thanks for watching. I think we're pushing on towards the end of this little section here. So I'll see you next time. And uh, you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.